Okay, uh, just made a box review earlier. Yeah, and just kind of slow. We have a preview of what the other video was. Here's my slip. Okay, so one six inch barrel, uh, PR 77, 1.77 pellet air rifle, or air gun, sorry. And two box of a 12 grand CO2 cylinder. One bag of extra magazine. They come with two, so now I have four. Okay. So basically, that's it. Let's get on with the unboxing. It looks like this particular box is sealed. And there's a hinge here. So I'm going to cut that open. With a scissor. I always found the best way is just to cut right where the crease is. Um, so just in case I need to return this. The box still looks semi-usable. If you just cut straight through the box, um, they might have a hard time to sell it, resell it. If you just cut along the crease, all you need to do is put a duct tape or a clear tape around it. Okay, this is hard to cut. Maybe I can open up the gun this way. Okay. Yep. What is going on? Okay. So in their packaging, they did a hydraulic press here. So the whole thing is sealed. See how I pull that? It's ripping this apart. So I guess they do want you to destroy the box after all. I tried to preserve the box, but my good intention has been backfired. Jesus. Okay. Now, let's go ahead and pull the instructions out. There's a, there's a couple of things. Stop. Do not return this product to the store. Okay, so don't bring this back to the store. If you buy this at Bass Pro or Cabela's. Um... Adult Precision Air Gun, one year limited warranty. Here's the address for returning. Okay, so I guess I'll keep that for. I never keep this. If it's broke, it's broke. Um, it's not expensive, so it cost me more to send it back in today's uh, USPS rate. Registration card. This I might keep. This is the owner's manual. You can tell. Muzzle, front side, cylinder latch, cylinder, trigger, trigger guard, rear side, hammer, safety, moving grip, okay? I gotta scroll through this very quick for this unboxing review. You can hit pause at any time on YouTube or on in Instagram and see where you want to see. I'm gonna zoom into the safety function. Okay, open, fire, safe. Okay, we'll test that out, that out later. Insert cartridge. This is the kind of video I want to see, but I could not find a video like this. I'm going to make one for you guys. Okay, for the future people interested in buying this. So they know everything about this weapon, toy, or gun, air gun, before you buy it. Okay. At least the box. I'll see the box and the user manual. Okay, we pop the rotary in. Firing, turn to safety. Like, like I said, you can hit pause anytime to read all this. I'm going to slowly move through the paper. Here's a little bit. Here's a vintage piece. Okay. Uh, unload the magazines. Left, right turn. Vintage elevation. Okay, adjusting rear sight. Okay, this should be in 4K later. And here is the big cojone. All the parts you will need, find ammo if I break any or missing. It's a breakdown of the engineering diagram. 
Okay, I think that's it. Just that. So I'll keep. So that's a good thing. In case I lose this, I can always come back to the video and double check the video. Okay. Anything else? Nothing. Okay, so we're gonna pull the very first piece of paper out. Okay, this is just a piece of paper they have that we already went through in the box review. Like that way. And here it is. I'm very interested that magazines, before I open this one, should be identical. Um, this metal, but feels plastic, but it is metal. Okay. And it's, the thickness is, it's okay. The thickness is fine. So I got this um, H&M. I, I'm going to do a review on it. Um, so we, at least we can try it on during this open box to see how it fits. But let's go ahead and grab the gun. Again, it's an air gun. Off this. Okay. So that way. In the United States, you're required to have orange tip. I might have to paint this orange just in case if I don't want to get shot by police by accident. And here is the rifled barrel. And this spins. Here's the gun. It's not a toy. Don't be careless cause injuries okay read the owner's manual made in taiwan look at that it was a serial number i'm from taiwan so well, i'm from us but i'm born in taiwan this is great it's high quality stuff compared to china many people doesn't know most of high quality computer parts um engineering parts is all made in taiwan it costs a little more it used to be cheap labor now it's the cost it costs a little more right now in taiwan to make everything um due to the high quality and Smaller country with a, a lot of tech jobs. So this gun, I would like because it's uh, made in Taiwan. Also, here's one thing I saw in the other people's review. Let's see if we can zoom in correctly right here. Pellets only. Caliper point seven seven point one seven seven four point five millimeter. If you're in the UK, okay, it looks really cool. Okay, the hammer. Here's the safety earlier we we're looking at. Oh, wait, how does this work? Should have read it. Okay, currently it doesn't move anywhere. It's probably there's something else is on. And here's the hammer. It's also locked. The safety is locked. Oh, okay. Okay, I guess you gotta press, give a little. Feels like it couldn't push it. I give a little push. Safety is in the back. Safety in the back. And I give a little push to open. And let's, let's open up the chamber. Maybe I have to pull, the, pull this out to move this thing. It's different than my revolver. What is going on here? How do I pat, pop the magazines out? Let's look at this first. So this is the CO2 with a screw. Okay, that's really cool. There's no tool needed. And you just pop this sucker back in. Right there. Okay. How do I... Oh, that's very cool. See the barrel? There's a spring to the barrel. So every time you switch, it reseals the chamber so that less CO2 escape. Unlike rifle, uh, real guns, I have... Typically, you see this is where the gunpowder comes out. So you don't want to put your hand in the real revolver with the bullets. This a lot, a lot of glass radius comes out, and that gap right there is where the gunpowder is coming out. So if you accidentally put your finger there, or anything there, your thumb right there, it will shear your thumb, thumb right off the amount of um, gunpowder. And that's where the smoke comes out too, also out of the barrel. So revolver people would never own revolver. Would you, don't put your finger right here. For CO2, I believe it's okay because it's not that much power. For the real gun, you put your finger there, you put your thumb there, try to hold it that way. It's gonna, it's gonna break your thumb, okay? Now let's figure out how to... Uh, here's the vintage. Here's the barrel. Okay, let's look at this very quick. Little pin, fire action, double action, single, so it's double, and you click hit, and you hit shoot. That's one action, two action, double action, single action, okay. Huh, it's kind of funny, there's a slight delay to it. I mean, it's just for look, there's nothing really striking. Um, it's, it's an air rifle, but they do simulate 